In this video, we demonstrate the capability of our proposed approach for finding feature subspaces from the given multivariate data samples. The key idea is to apply clustering techniques to both rows and columns of the data matrix simultaneously by developing the improved version of a bi-clustering technique. This is a 12-dimensional synthetic data which contains four three-dimensional clusters with 10% noise and two six-dimensional clusters without noise. We start with our bi-clustering based analysis by setting the initial numbers of data and dimension clusters to 9 and 6 in this case respectively, where we can find these values according to the size of the input data samples and dimension. Our guideline here is to interactively eliminate uncorrelated dimensions and data samples of the block matrix diagram on the right button of the coordinate view until we can fully identify correlation among the data samples and dimensions in the reduced data set. As shown in this video, we first select the columns of this block matrix diagram by removing uncorrelated data dimensions and then rows to exclude noisy data samples step by step. Note that the system interactively runs our bi-clustering approach three times in order to find a good result to proceed. Finally, we can find the most correlated set of subspaces by introducing various types of rendering styles to parallel coordinates plots and scatter plot matrices. Our system also allows us to recover the intimate status of the overall by clustering based analysis by clicking the nodes of the history tree at the bottom of the coordinate view in the system. We also tackle the USDA food composition dataset as a real world example. Note that in this dataset, each data sample corresponds to a specific food while each dimension represents a kind of nutrition composed in each food. We again conducted by clustering analysis to find 9x9 nine nine subspaces in the dataset. Dimensions labeled as vitamin B12, vitamin A, sodium, and vitamin E were first deleted from the block matrix diagram to preserve the correlation in the data. Following the affirmation guideline, we delete fully correlated dimensions together with minor data clusters step by step to extract a new set of correlated subspaces. By removing additional dimensions and data samples, we can finally find a small set of correlated feature subspaces. Throughout our experiments, we can observe that the pair of energy and water is the most strongly correlated, while protein and vitamin B6 are also highly correlated. Furthermore, we can identify relationships between the two correlated subspaces through our contract PCP representation. In this case study, we have been conducting is related to blazers, which are very compact quasars associated with the presumed supermassive black hole at the center of an active giant elliptical galaxy. The challenging task here is to visually explore correlation among these parameters, aiming at blazer classification and behavior abnormality isolation based primarily on such polarized light observation. We started with 6x6 six six block clusters and iteratively contracted dimensions and eliminated outlier data samples to obtain a correlation structure in a 3x2 block clusters. Besides, the cluster structure of the final data plot can be enhanced with the strip rendered view. From the derivations, it was easily anticipated that polarization variable corrected with total intensity have strong correlations with their originals respectively. In addition, it was contrary to the expectation from astrophysics that the two parameters, total intensity and color index, did not remain as key blazer discriminators.